So Darren, a uh, good way to end our Premier Sports Cup campaign. Yeah, no, delighted. Um, I disappoint, I think. I don't know if it was the final scores came in there, but I don't know if they lost it in goal difference again. Um, not quite sure if it was a goal difference or a point, because a couple of games went to the penalties. But no, look, it's, it's been a very, very good campaign, very strong. Um, obviously a great start against Dumbarton uh, another great performance against Rafe and a deserved victory with the, the penalties obviously got a bit of a, a going over with Aberdeen on Tuesday night but again it was great reaction I asked for a reaction for the boys tonight we made I think it was five or six changes, uh, so it kind of shows you the, the strength and depth. Um, at the same time, we've managed to give young young Greg Harrow his debut, and young Kieran came on the day did very well, and uh, he made his debut as well. So it was good to good to see him, good to be in a position to be able to do that. And a hat trick for Dale Carrot. Yeah, you no, know, we're having a joke with Dale when uh, when they had to be head knock there, and um, saying we, we kept him on because trying to get his hat trick and then sure enough he, he pops up and again it was a great bit of play we've managed to nick it high Danny's just took it off the boy Kieran's come in for the right and then it was good one two touch play um, right in the deal's path and then he, he finished so no delighted um, great start to the game um, ball came in and again I think even before then we had a chance one or two chances to, to maybe go one up uh, corner came in and it's something we kind of spoke about and again Dale whipped it in it was very similar to the, the Aberdeen game where Dale gets cleared off the line with Johnny Hayes um, so we, we get the early, knee, the early lead it settles us down um, Harrison as well coming into David's debut I think you can kind of see he's He's obviously short of match practice, so it was good to get him uh, 90 minutes under his belt. Um, unfortunately, with Leachy coming off, uh, we have wee knock, so again, we're hoping it's nothing major. Uh, but at the same time, it's, it gives other guys opportunities. But no, it doesn't disappoint. Hopefully, he's okay. Kenny and the doc will kind of see to him and, and, and kind of deal with him. But um, second goal, again, very similar. I, I felt going in at half time, we could have been and should have been a couple of goals up. Danny Burns got a good couple of areas, um, and again, a good couple of strikes, uh, a couple of good saves for the keeper. Um, but then second half again the similar one with the corner coming in with Danny um, and Dale Carrick getting on the end of it again so it's just one of those wings he's a kind of fo fox in the box so it was great for him to kind of get back on the score sheet and then top it off with the, with the hat-trick right at the end and a clean sheet for Calum Law in the defence yeah great to get the clean sheet as well we said that as well at half time can we kind of keep that that same intensity, I think they came into it the last 5-10 minutes, I'm pretty sure they got a roll looking at half time um, and again they, they, they did, but I think once we kind of settled down and knocked the ball about again it was it was great, some of the football on show was, was really really good um, and again it, it gives us that boost, 3 goals, clean sheet, finishing, well hopefully we'll finish second in the group depending on the on the Rafe game tomorrow um, and again it's, it's it's unlucky, unlucky not to maybe go through, but at the same time uh, I'm, I'm more than happy with the performance the guys have put in and uh, I mean the performances as well. It's the, the way we've played, the way we've defended, uh, taking the, the Aberdeen game aside. Um, uh, all the other games are against guys in a league above, two leagues above, uh, and we've more than competed and, and matched them all over the park. So really, really happy with, with how it's gone. And on to the start of the league next week, away to Dumbarton. Yeah, no, again, it's three, four weeks now since we last played them, but we, they'll know all about us, we'll know all about them. Uh, and now I've just got decisions to make regarding personnel. Again, guys have come in and did well. Uh, they're chatting the door. Tomo left out today just with injury. We, we changed up today, so... Again, it's a good position to be in, it's a good decision to have to make. Uh, obviously, there'll be some guys un unhappy or disappointed, but at the same time, it's a, it's a squad game um, and we expect them to be unhappy, but at the same time, whatever team we go with, 100% um, of these guys will be, if they're on the bench, then they'll come in. We expect them to, to come in and, and one, help the guys that are in that position just now, but at the same time, when they get their opportunity themselves to go and take that. Uh, and as I say, we need the full squad from now to the end of the season. This is a we're kind of bread and butter now, the league, the league campaign, so we need to kind of show these same performances, show these the same defensively, attacking wise, um, and again, be, be hard to beat. Um, so hopefully, we can combine all that together and we can, we can start off with a, with a win down at Dumbarton. Thanks very much, Darren. Thank you.